Hello. I'm gonna make a quick review on this battle song right here from Etsy. It's a 3D printed battle song trainer by Cubelink. So let's get right into it. So it is 2.2 ounces, which is fairly light. It's 3D printed. It's made out of plastic. It's like hidden, hidden pin design. Which, um, those are the pins. It's like inside the plastic. It's part of the handles, which I think is pretty cool. And um, honestly, this thing is only 20 bucks and I think it flips great. It's my first plastic battle song trainer. Battle song and I've had it for about a week now and really enjoying it. It's just something different to flip. It's a lie. I think for 20 bucks, this is completely worth worth it. On the uh, website, you can choose you can choose the blade color, bite handle, and safe handle color. And um, it uses these um, like pivots. I'm not really sure what size they are. And uh, has these rubber bands on there for cushion. There isn't really any any a handle gap at all, so these are good just to provide some sort of comfort, comfort, comfort. But as far as flipping goes, it's it's pretty great. Balance is about like right there, kinda. So good balance. Um, the only trick I could say I have a really kind of a hard time doing with this is behind the eight ball. Just feels kind of weird with these things being so big. But honestly, I can do almost every other trick I can do with this battle song. Uh, I can do helix, fine. Oh gosh, let me try that again. Short stops, good, fans. Um, choker fans, a little awkward. Frick, but you know. So again, it's like made of complete plastic, except for, um, the pivots something and it has the logo on there which i think is pretty cool so the shipping shipping was pretty fast I, they are almost sold out so i would say if you're interested check it out now but you could probably wait they'll restock eventually of course but um yeah, it sounds, oh, there it goes. It sounds pretty clanky, but it's not, it's not a horrible sound. Uh, design in there is pretty cool. So, like, fits right in there. Honestly, it, it's, there's, like, no, there's, like, barely any distance or, uh, sp not distance, space between the blade and the handle when it goes in there. But tap, you, you can't really hear it because it's, like, no room for it to move, really. Oh, I lost the rubber band. What do you know? It's kind of what happens, but... Where'd that rubber band go? I guess you can just use, um... It was white. You can use any kind of just rubber band. I think it comes, uses, like, hair ties. Just, like, two or three of them. I knew where that rubber band went. I got more, so... For 20 bucks, I think this is great. Um, if you're a beginner, like this is gonna be your first battle song, I'm gonna say it's gonna be really awkward. This is transition, the transition to a metal battle song. It's gonna be really awkward. But like after flipping this one for a while, going on to like, my Antarctic feels, feels kind of wacky. We're not here to talk about that though. So I would say, it's great, honestly, for anyone to pick this up. I think it's amazing to have an extra 20 bucks laying around. Really fun. I just see myself picking this up, flipping it often, so often recently. Just because of just how different it feels from, you know, probably because my first plastic. But for me, I think this is great. But if you are a beginner, I would say get this. But try to get, you know, like a, maybe another trainer that's more metal. Maybe a little smaller because this is kind of... 
It's a little bigger for a ballast song, but but I think it fits it. I think it fits it well. If it was small, it'd just be sliding out your fingers and stuff. But as far as grip goes, it has um, some some pattern. To, it gives it some good grip. It's also light, so I, I never really had it slide on my fingers before. But um, yeah. So it's kind of about it. It is, you know, super great. I think the design. I love the design. Um, you know, I think what he had in mind for this battle song is just to make something that, um, kind of like the goal with the squid he has that squid entries had with the squiddy, just something that you can flip around in public. But this doesn't look like a knife at all. It replicates a knife, of course, but you can't. It's obviously not a real knife. It's like purple everything you can't really like it's really just a toy honestly like so i want to say don't bring this to school of course don't be dumb honestly you're gonna get some teacher getting mad at you and all that stuff and you know just don't bring these things to school in general never bring them to school because you know people don't know what to think with these things so they're just gonna bring them and teachers aren't gonna like that um some kids gonna snitch on you who knows just don't bring these, of course. But yeah, let me know if you like this video. It's my first review. I'm going to do a few more. I got another ballast line coming in. I should make this video. This video will be made on um, Wednesday or Thursday. So check that out. So yeah, that's that's it for the 3D printed Etsy ballast line. Yep.